Right, hello everybody, welcome to the uh, first round of Chalice. We're starting with a quick snap. Um, Segolo versus Shawnee. Um, Shawnee's incredible 16 man Wood Elves. He's got a miss next game. So only 15 for this game. Loads of guard, loads of movement, agility, everything. Um, Singolo with a very trim 11 man squad. <laughs> what he's brought for his 1,000 TV of inducements <laughs> is three, <laughs> three brides, a wizard. And uh, a an mercenary dirty player. And uh, a babe. And probably a chef, right? I feel like there's been a chef here. Stolen a reroll. That's what I think. I believe Shawnee got up to four. I don't know, though. Zingolo's going to foul the tree, isn't he, just instantly? Well, he makes a removal. I mean, he could die, Shawnee, here. Well, that, that's, his, that's his win condition, isn't it? He's just literally casting every elf. But, I mean, he's got to be worried about the backfield. The backfield pressure that could come. Yeah, Shoney's got a mighty blow, hasn't he? Well, was that was that thick skull that saved him? I think it was, wasn't it? He rolled a seven, which would have got bumped to an eight, but there was no need because it wouldn't make any difference. So it didn't it didn't pop up that thick skull triggered, but it did. Yeah, it would be a dicey, Pedro. <laughs> it's still got to be a dicey. <laughs> Just because of the nature of the game, isn't it? And removals being so random. But he has played this terribly single. <laughs> so he's made this foul, but in doing so, he has opened a gaping hole. Which, you know... Against Shawnee's Woodies, showing him a gaping hole, unlikely it would turn out well for you. Yes, definitely dwarves hurt more by the blizzard. Zero hesitation from Shawnee. He's going straight for that gaping hole. He's exploding through that gaping hole. <laughs> Rather into into the gaping hole. <laughs> it's a bit harder to get around this side though, isn't it? Because at the moment this is doing nothing. <laughs> he's just he's just caging over here. So he needs he needs to get around this side as well. Like, this is terrible. I mean, it, it, I guess it's maybe getting a shot next turn, but he's got to do something to... He uh... really needs two more guys here. And he's given up this massive hit, isn't he? I mean, surely he's not going to enjoy this, is he? <laughs> you know, with, like, three dirty players. <laughs> All this mighty blow. <laughs> This is not fun for Shawnee, so he's using sidesteppers to hold to hold this screen. Which I would have rather had an extra player in there, but fair enough. Question is whether Singolo 3Ds them or not. But he just opens with a foul! <laughs> I mean, to be fair, there's no reason not to open with a foul, is there? He's got three. He's got three bribes, and he can use them all. <laughs> so, well, it's not a two D. Is it? it? Could be a three D. He could. He could go in for the three D. 
I think he probably has to do the 3D. Yeah, yeah, he's going for the 3D. Gets him. gets in the cage and it's like okay it's not that comfortable for him but I do feel like an extra player would have made it harder for him and I think Shawnee should have tried to get an another player around TBH fan hello Frosty I'm not polishing my nails on the side <laughs> what <laughs> Yeah, no longer a gaming hall. I was, I was, I don't know. I felt like Shawnee didn't need that extra player in there. Yeah, exactly, Ducky. Yeah, there's some weird noise. There's a dog outside. Go on. <laughs> KO should all be Kaz. Yeah, four KOs out on turn two. <laughs> Has got to make Shawnee think about this. I mean, he's, he's on a clock, isn't he? <sighs> he gets the... He gets the stun. He gets the stun. Um, he got three, three bribes. A wizard, a babe, and probably a chef. <laughs> oh, and a, and a loner, mercenary, dirty player. <laughs> Rolls a one. That's the good thing about having nine tackle. And the chef. Like, the chef makes all of the... Uh, Makes all the tackle better, doesn't it? Now just dodging. Oh, I don't have just punch him, man. Just, just move this guy to here and punch him. Punch, punch, punch. Or him to there. I would, you know, do do a punch there, and then he could have just dodged. Three. Hello, Dibby! I believe there was a chef involved, yeah. Dibby! Yeah, Blizzard's perfect, isn't it? If, for the dwarves, as long as you don't have to GFI, then um, it's working out brilliant for him, as it, as it fucks with the one turn, for sure. Hello, D! Probably, maybe, yeah. <laughs> well, definitely, maybe, isn't it? The old, uh, the old oasis. Just goes up and punches, doesn't he? There's no need to get, no need to get clever with this. Weird that Shoney dodged out his best guy last. Like he had, he had a defenseless dude, which maybe thinks okay, higher knockdown chance and gains mighty blow. And he's got a wrestle dude, but surely the block guard is is one you want to care more about. So now he's got his two dancers. Which again, like if it was Gadenik, he'd have his two dancers and he'd be pretty happy about that. And it was really all he'd care about. Whereas for Shawnee, he cares about everybody, doesn't he? So it gets a bit harder. To have lost this many players is pretty crazy. <laughs> In three turns. Like it is a dice and no matter how you slice it. Thus far. But he's got his one turn chance. Possibly in the snow. But yeah, he's not he's not turning him over this half. Sadly we, we can't see the banter, can we? We cannot see the banter. Um the absolute tragedy of not being able to see chat. Oh, 
holy single, holy single. <laughs> Dave, yeah, Dave did survive, didn't he? Dave did survive. He did well. <laughs> Necropotence. Wait a minute. Is this necroimpotence? But they were absolutely rock hard today. <laughs> no man. Um Hello Necroimpotence. <laughs> Oh god, Kingslayer's here. <laughs> Please try to calm down on the sound effects and the emotes, Kingslayer. <laughs> We're gonna see another big foul here. Hello, HTK. Is he gonna get a Kaz? Not deleted, just out temporarily. You know, and even if even if only one comes back, Shawnee still has a full team for the second half. <laughs> so the problem the problem with attrition against Shawnee's team is it doesn't it's basically a mute attrition. <laughs> and like that is the good thing, although you know he's got four catches so he can't protect all the catches, but on the other hand, he's got four fucking catches. So he's got six good players, hasn't he? And while his dancers aren't as amazing as Gdanix, they're still fucking dancers with some skills. So it's pretty hard to. Uh, it's probably better off to stop fouling now, right? The the drives won. So you're probably better off saving your three bribes for the second half and overtime. Or maybe not. Maybe it is better just to pile on the pain and just try and remove people. Try desperately to get a Kaz, even if it costs you a bribe or two. <laughs> Fell twice a turn if possible. Thanks, Kingslayer. It's a bit it's a little bit much sometimes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Do it. And he's surrounding this one. He wants his foul next turn as well. <laughs> oh dear. I don't know. I think VLGF muted. As good as it is. You know, muted implies a certain amount of weakness, doesn't it? Muted implies you ain't up to the chat bands. I feel like like the preemptive muted. I think it's good when they've just when they're just starting to salt and then you just go muted by the way. <laughs> if you're saying anything, you're muted. I think that's a I think that's a power chat move. <laughs> I think you've got to drop the muted, <laughs> just as they're starting, <laughs> just as they're starting to tilt. Oh, play on Xbox. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, he's going for the old hit on the hit on the <laughs> DP. Lovely. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Oh, well, although he's done that, the Adge Fiver can get hit now by this fella, can he? Unless he does something. Or he could hit a Dancer, but I think I'd rather hit the uh, Adge Fiver. Hit the Adge Fowler, Adge Fiver, then stomp him in the nuts. That's definitely foul the Adge Fiver. I mean, I just didn't think it was worth fouling like a shitty lineman, you know, that was the thing. What this one, was this the last one he fouled? The Roger, I don't know, just fucking leave him. You found him for Kaz at this point, so, so foul the good players. Like, he's got to use his, he's got to use his bribe if he gets sent off, that's the thing, right? He's only got the one dirty player, so... 
I know he's got three foul, three bribes, but still. Once the bribe has won this hard, I think I would have saved it this half. I would have saved it for good players. Second half would foul everybody. Three bribes, probably a chef. It's not going away either, is it? This at the top there. Three bribes, a babe, a wizard, a dirty player, um, long beard, and probably, probably a chef. Dead. There you go. Fouling him was worth it. Was that worth it to get a mighty blow hit on the long beard? On the dirty player? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe you'd have been better off just staying away from that long beard. Oh, now he's gone towards the ball. Dirty Dino, Shawnee. Oh. <laughs> Oh, if he fails this, he's getting his head stoved in. Nope. He makes it. G'day, cocky. Does he just tag this guy so he can't foul the dancers? <laughs> yeah, he does. <laughs> oh, dear me. Well, that's okay, at least there's some, some threat, the uphill wrestle on the, uh, on the ball is there. Hello, Otto. Yeah, it's pretty rough, isn't it, knowing that you're, you're facing fouling every single turn for the rest of the game. Well, yeah, probably. Probably getting fouled every single turn for the rest of the game. Oh. Is this the blitz? Yeah. <laughs> he fails. So he gets the uphill with a wrestle. I guess. I like. I guess you've got to go for it, haven't you? It's the only way you're going to stop the touchdown. But that that move there, he could have just hit this guy and fouled him, couldn't he? That might have been better. <laughs> that might have been better, just hitting him and fouling him. But no, I don't like fouling fouling this shit, to be honest. It's just me. Another one for Shawnee. Wow. He obviously saves his reroll for the one turn. Now, do you foul here? I guess you do. You've got all the bribes, but one, two, three, four, you can't get. Unless you chain him. Could chain him, right? Can he? One, two, three, four. No, he doesn't have. Oh, yeah, he does. One, two, three, four. And it can go one, two, three, four. No, I couldn't. No, I can't really. I can foul him with more assists. Yep. Gets a free D. Kaz is in. Roto. Oh, God. Shawnee's just... <laughs> oh, God. This is going to be a mental challenge for Shawnee, isn't it? it just, his whole team's just disappearing in front of his eyes. Oh, dear. I mean, it's far from GG. This is only one player on a 15-man team. <laughs> no, Tony. It's going to be challenging mentally. <laughs> so, yeah, Shawnee doesn't even care about the KOs, right? Because he'll get enough back. He's got so many players. And he does. He's back up to 11. And he might even get everyone back anyway. So he's down the dancer. Obviously, it's not great losing a dancer, but his dancers weren't even good, so it doesn't matter so much. <laughs> they weren't even good. They weren't amazing. Like, as good as that is, when you compare it to Gdynik's, um dancers, <laughs> it seems pretty shit. And his own catches.
Yeah, currently 15. <laughs> Fuck's sake. <laughs> eh, not dead, only minus edge. Sparky nearly won Chalice with a with a minus edge dancer. <laughs> a minus edge mighty blow dancer. So there you go. <laughs> yeah, I wonder Gadenik. We could all learn a thing or two from K Fog. The good thing for Shawnee is he's got so much guard. It, this isn't so scary, is it? To to stop him, like he can have three guards here and just still steam in with a 2D. It's not shit. It's not shit. It's just. It's just. It's just not as exciting as Gadenik's strength four or edge five uh, <laughs> dancers, is it? You know, like it's good, but it's uh, and it's not that good. Hello, calcium, glorious. Oh, commiserations, calcium. I, I didn't realize you were playing Dimming yesterday. I would have casted it, even though you were both streaming it. I would have still casted it because I thought it'd be fucking funny. But it was good watching the VOD, so thank you very much. Getting on comms with Jimmy was great. Yeah, he did, yeah, yeah. Commiserations. <laughs> he punished you. Would backlining not be better? I don't know. I think push denial is usually better than backlining. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Go around the side. Is he going to fill in these and then hit him and then sidestep forward and then hit him again? <laughs> Glorious Kelsey. Yeah, they are still, yeah. Yeah, they are. <laughs> like, you know, like that's the thing. It's it's unfair to, to berate Shawnee's war dancers. Just because they don't live up to that. That ridiculous standard set by uh, set by Gadernik. So you just do the pass first. Do the do the pass first. Pass first. If only gets pushes on the on the on the second hit. He's got a leap now, hasn't he? Follow and leap. He's given up. I oh, don't. Did he only need one push? Oh, he only, he only needed one push. He only needed one push. He's got plus movement. Never mind. He hasn't got sure feet. Fucked. <laughs> Sorry, you've got to remember this is first thing in the morning for me at 11 o'clock. <laughs> yeah, pass first was best, wasn't it? Like, it was just genuinely best because... Because then, you know, if he only gets the, uh... It was Chef, so he gets two. Wasn't it? It's, 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 it's pass first, because you're going to have to make it anyways. You might as well do it now, in case you haven't powered him. I don't know. Plus strength on Rudolph Lino. I like it, Calcium. A lot of people wouldn't. A lot of people like going guard. They're like, you know, skipping the strength and going guard. 
Um, but I like his I like his strength. <laughs> it was the million fouls fucked him out yet. <laughs> Millions fouls and ones. And he's not going out yet, is he? He's still got the whole half. Um, but he has got to endure, you know, another eight turns of getting gang fouled every turn. <laughs> the dice have not favoured him so far, but, you know, Singolo's done what he had to do, hasn't he? He has fouled relentlessly. He has hit people that have been presented to him. Singolo's done all the right things, but I mean, it's it's not it's not a mark on Singolo. It's just how stupid Shawnee's team is that anyone who beats him has had to have diced him. Basically, <laughs> there's no beating Shawnee without dicing him. But the you know for him to win this round is 64, 32, 16, 8, 4, and final. He's got to win six games without getting diced, doesn't he? Or without having a massive brain fart or whatever. Dakar, I think he will. Dakar, yeah, yeah. This is the. There's no need to start everyone super far back, is there? You can just start them like this, protecting against a blitz a bit. I mean, but he also hit people, didn't he? And he engineered the blitz. He engineered the fouls and everything. Like it was better than better that he played it kind of right. Like I think he. I think it was the kind of right strategy was to go for the, especially the the chef, just because you know you've got nine tackle. And uh, so, you know, reducing his rerolls seems that much better, doesn't it? Especially with overtime. So I quite, I quite like going for the chef. Um, I kind of think three bribes is a bit excessive, but hey. Dakar. The Dakar is is uh, an invention of Matt Dakar on Fumble. And basically, it's, it's like what you're seeing here. You just run the fuck away. <laughs> You just run the fuck away, and uh, <laughs> and it limits how much attrition you can take because obviously the stupid dwarves have just got to walk four squares forward now and can't hit anybody. And the next turn they've got to walk four squares forward to threaten hitting somebody, and then you know you can get round the sides and get in behind them. And he's got to eat that, hasn't he? With only two rerolls. So there you go. With four rerolls, he probably rerolls that, doesn't he? Maybe. Not. I know, Femi. Uh, <laughs> needs must when the devil drives. That's the thing, isn't it? You know, I, if I'm not going to be playing as much, I've got to be casting more, haven't I? So these fucking weirdos playing games of blood ball, waking up before midday. Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah, they need the natural light in their basements. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, Shoney could be punished by his wrestle there as that gives him the foul. And <laughs> he goes straight in for zero hesitation. Hopefully, Pedro. <laughs> I could do, yeah. I could do. It's Wolfpack, yeah. <laughs> 200 subs for squats and then 400 subs for a stream tomorrow <laughs> check the SFX and Clips channel Jim. check the bloody SFX channel ok god if I must if I must. What's this? <laughs> I don't think we need that. Oh dear. I know, yeah, Doug the Dog. Yeah, he's fouled. He's fouled nearly every turn. I think he's made eight fouls. <laughs> Brilliant baby. <laughs> oh dear me. So now he's gotta reroll the pickup, hasn't he? If he fails to pick up this turn, he has to use one of his two rerolls, I think. With it being on the sideline and exposed. Oh. 
entre ses mains. Que va-t-il en faire <laughs> That's great. Let's pick. It's great the blitz pit scene, isn't it? Oh god, yeah. Yeah, it'd be brilliant, wouldn't it? It would be like you know, fair play to Amaranth. It'd be fucking brilliant to be a titty stream there. <laughs> it would be fucking brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that that could be that could be your hook. <laughs> oh, I don't think so, Fabian. Anyway, no. <laughs> yeah, that's true, Tom. That's true. Nope, there's a removal. The old armor six guy, and his armor. Uh, oh no, he was move six. He's just got nine CV. He, he's not going to double G if I had to a player, but uh, I can't foul anyway. There's a screen. Oh, tragedy. Tragedy for Singolo. He can't foul. <laughs> Nobody wants to see my toes. <laughs> He's taken extreme attrition, isn't he, Shawnee? Like, basically every hit is being a removal here. Every hit and every foul. Like, it's pretty crazy. The amount of damage he's taking. But he's just got to, uh, he's just got to keep his head down, hasn't he? And, uh, keep, keep working and hope that the dice turn. And, you know, at the end of the day, if he can stall this out and win the toss, he just wins, doesn't he? Exactly, Femi, yeah, that's true. <laughs> Except if Rego started streaming. <laughs> Until the day that Rego starts streaming. Oh, dear. <laughs> yeah, not even the average BB, not even the average BB streamer, Femi. I think the best BB streamers could. <laughs> the worst ones would get put down police before they even got to the bells. Christ, you can't say that for me. Fucking hell. I did like the idea of uh, Rick Reckless's OnlyFans. Oh my god. <laughs> and so, yeah. <laughs> yeah, the old. Uh, oh! Oh, he just greets it. He just insta greets it. Because Shawnee can't protect him from the from the DP foul. Um, that is true, yeah. That's why. That's why some people, some mean people, call them the Super Banger Brothers. Hello, Doctor Augusto. <laughs> Bad for life with eye holes. <laughs> Another removal. <laughs> this is insane. <laughs> Imagine ever not removing somebody. Singolo can't. Little weak over here, but because he's got the penetration, it's harder to get around that side. Oh, dear me. <laughs> Surprise, yeah. Fucking Captain's balding, innit? <laughs> Without being mean to him. 
He reminds me of Captain Spaulding. He doesn't really look that much like him, but he just reminds me of him. It's, I mean, well, not cars. No, there haven't been that many cars. There's been like four cars. But there's been like a remo more than a removal per turn, it feels like. Loads of KOs. Oh, he doesn't get it! <laughs> oh, he just needed the push to burst through and then get a screen. Oh, no, surely no. Oh, he's just going to make the dice rolls anyway. He's just going to potato it up. This is rough, isn't it? This is really rough. Oh, God. He does a 3 plus GFI. Oh, God. Oh, this is horrible. You might as well make another one, Sean. Okay, yeah, that's a big tag, isn't it? That's a big tag on that guy. Oh, he makes that tag as well. Oh, he dodges again! Oh, I quite like tagging this guy. He's got the ball. You roll the one! <gasps> Unbelievable. Big up Tato Nation. Absolute dicing. Well, that was the dice that Shoney needed, wasn't it? So now the question is, does he go for the, uh, the, uh, the Slayer, which has got a GFI to hit, but would get two hits, or the straight up, uh, the straight up runner needing a pal off two dice into picking it up himself? That's the question. <laughs> yeah, J5, <Jeff>, yeah. <laughs> Glorious Tato. I, he, that's genuine, he genuinely could ignore the ball, right? And just go 1-1. One, one. Doesn't get the pow. He could have even made it 3D from the uh, from the Slayer as well, couldn't he? He could have just put him down, given up on recovery, and gone for a 6 dice on the ball, or 6 or 9 dice on the ball. I don't think it was a great idea. Imagine if he'd had a fucking glitter, he could have done that. So I think at this point, Shoney's happy to just score a touchdown. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I think Shoney's going to score this turn if he can. Or, you know, get the ball safe if he can. But either way, I think he would take the score if he, you know what I mean? Like, I don't, I don't think he's going to be that obsessed about trying to stall it here. And hope he can hold them off for four turns. But now... He's going to have to roll decent on his... He's only got four res reserves. So he's going to have to roll better than average to have a full team. He just goes for the 3-2. And takes the tutty. He takes the tutty. And now Singor has a golden opportunity to win this in normal time. He rolls below average for his KOs. He is down two players. <laughs> There's been a lot of attrition. A tutty streamer, yeah. You gotta love that Singolo's made like 10 fouls or something. And hasn't hasn't been caught once. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, 
Yeah, like this is doable, isn't it? It's not easy, obviously. It's not easy to get the tutty here in four turns against Woody's. But he's got a chance. Shoney does have a 16 man Woodell team, but one is missed next game, so there's only 15 for this match. He gets an extra re roll. <laughs> only 15, yeah. <laughs> And that's the thing, is it? There's a chance of Shorty getting in the way. Oh my god, so tired. Getting in the way and like stopping him scoring. Or making it, you know, making it so that he has to give Shorty a kind of decent shot at the ball. And if he gives Shorty a decent shot at the ball, he can turn him over. If Shorty doesn't get a decent shot at the ball, then he probably doesn't turn him over. But then if he doesn't give him a decent shot at the ball, maybe he can't get the traction to get forward, so it will be interesting. Interesting the day he plays over here. I would have thought this was like, you know, blitz one of the catchers and foul them. Rather than just a shitty lineman. I finished one about two. I was I was tired at two and then once I laid in bed for two hours I was wide awake. And I got to sleep about five. Problem with the tree is it just gets taken out. Instantly by the air troll slayer. He doesn't even have to daunt this, he's just strength four. Not very unlikely to get stuck on him with frenzy, isn't it? Two seventy five percent knockdowns. I guess he's gonna foul the tree, isn't he? He fouled the tree in the first half, I guess he'll foul him in the second half as well. I don't like not crossing halfway line though. But hey, gets the guard in all the corners, uh, except the Troll Slayer one. He hasn't blitzed, has he? Unless he does a 1D. Unless he does a cheeky 1D. One direction. Just does the foul first, make sure you get that foul in with a negative assist. And it gives him the assist for the blitz. Yeah, I like not, I like not needing the assist to hit the catchers. And also like the more valuable players anyway. Oh my god, he only makes a stun. Just how unlucky can you get? <laughs> Singolo must be utterly confused. <laughs> Unbelievable. He hit, he hit an elf and it didn't instantly explode. Holy shit. I don't like not just punching, honestly. Just put him in there and punch him. Were you playing at Chorney? Were you fucking playing at Chorney? Put him in there and punch the bastard. Like, you kind of protect him anyway, don't you, by uh, following up on the hit if you power him. And even if you don't, he's got, he's got sides. Oh, and he's totally exposed anyway. Okay, he tags the DP. <laughs> Fair enough, he tags the DP. Frenzy trap now, though, from this hit. Oh, no stand firm. Feel the dauntless. Singolo could have put this guy in first. He's got the skull. Oh, he gets away with it. He could have at least put this guy in first, couldn't he? Just to uh, just to protect against that, but he just didn't bother. Of course, he goes for the frenzy trap. Not punished. Oh, 
never any justice. Hello, Chunterino. <laughs> just the, just the, just Shawnee's elves getting obliterated, yeah. Well. Yeah, he could be, he could be, shouldn't he? He could be. <laughs> the glory of Min Max Dwarves. And he, he's given up the foul, he could have stood up and fouled. Why did, what, what's he playing at? Why did he stand this guy up? For no reason. He could have done that blitz and then fouled. God, this team's going to get even better in Blood Bowl 2020, isn't it? Because he could, he'd get assists from these two. <laughs> yeah, <it was> bad. <laughs> For fuck's sake, <laughs> That ball, yeah, he's he's out of range, in fact, isn't he? But that's the, that's the problem. This is the problem against Shawnee's team, isn't it? Like, Shawnee doesn't have the wonder the wonder dancers that Gdernik has, but, you know, all he has to do is kind of stand in the way, and then Singolo can't just fucking dance around and go past him, can he? So, like, he's just got to hold, hold the line, and then Singolo's either got to expose the ball a little bit and maybe get turned over and lose... Or he's just got a turt like this and not go anywhere, so... The tree could base the ball, yeah. Hope to base, base, base. The, the tree could hit the ball, in fact, couldn't it? Which is probably the better thing to do. Takes not that many dice. Um, dodge this guy to here, this guy, this guy, blitz him, push him into there, push the tree to there, hit the ball. The only problem is it takes away some of your recovery to do that, but it's pretty nice. Oh, he stand firm. <laughs> he stand firm, disregard. Disregard, he stand firm. <laughs> he's fucking... He's the one stand firm player that he's got on the field. Fuck's sake. So he can't do that. He can't do that wonderful player. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Oh, I thought it was so clever. I thought I was so clever, but no. It's the one stand firm, asshole. Maybe he's better off just hitting the slayer. I just gotta hit him. There you go. And it's the DP. <laughs> Doesn't get the AV break. <laughs> yeah, might as well stand him up. So he's got to stand up the DP, get the guard in, and then he can 2D him, can't he? Needs to get one of his blitzers downfield as a scoring threat. Oh, wait. <laughs> there, is no, uh, there is no elf in scoring range, so Singolo can just go potato this if he has to. He's got to do something to get in a range. He can just go for the dodge away. He doesn't even need to uh, just do the hit. He could just dodge. Maybe the ball just goes up to here, and then he 3Ds the catcher. Yeah, the, we the weakness of this move, like, you know, tagging him or putting him there, however he's going to do it, the weakness of that is it does take a guy away from moving upfield, doesn't it? Or downfield, whichever you want to call it. I think maybe ball here. Oh, you could, I guess the ball can go here, can't it? Yeah, the ball goes there. 
he blitzes and, and screens and he moves up the screen as well. Like he might as well, he's got nothing to lose. Yeah, he hasn't he hasn't he hasn't got caught once. Is he gonna greed this? That's really greedy if he greeds that. He doesn't He did go for the master check, yeah. He did, that's why I shot he's only got one reroll. He took two rerolls. Um so Shawnee started this half with two instead of four. Uh, it's one one. And Singolo's in scoring range, so Shawnee could definitely lose this in normal time. If it goes to overtime you'd fancy on Shawnee Shawnee winning it if he wins the toss. Yes, Falk, yes, I think he absolutely should have, against nine players, he should have just stuck a fucking long beard on the tree. Stuck his worst long beard on the tree and fucking pushed up. He should have stuck his shitty ass fucking dirty player on the tree, in fact, and just scored against nine players. You know, like, you've got a two-man advantage. Oh, he's even got a rookie. He's got a literal rookie, but even then, just put the fucking dirty player on the tree, fuck it. And just smash forward. He should have absolutely just mashed forward and tried to score and fall. But hey, oh glorious though. But yep, he gets the two D. He gets the pow. Um, it is just first score wins. You big spray can. So like, um, it's just literally you roll off whoever wins the toss, um, you know, chooses to kick or receive and therefore chooses to receive and then first goal wins. No re-rolls here. There will be a dirty player foul though. <laughs> that I'm pretty certain. <laughs> Because Singolo's never been one for caring about the ball at the best of times. So he's probably just going to punch everything, free up his dirty player, and foul him. Yeah, there's no scoring threat, so unless he chains him somehow. Having no blitzes is terrible, isn't it? It's just genuinely terrible. Got to think about this because he's got to he's got to get his DP f free for a dancer foul I think. <laughs> Nothing. Now nah, the draft takes ages, so there's no draft coverage. <laughs> Yeah, it's really weird that he hasn't gone for it, but honestly, Russians tend to skimp on edge three one way or the other. They either they either tend to like not have a runner or not have blitzers. I don't know why. Oh, big cars! Because it stops it stops him being twat magneted by single. He's just got a 1D here, hasn't he? He's just got a 1D. <laughs> he scores! <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, boy, here we go. Huge roll for the coin toss. Lords of Reserves back for Shawnee. 
Ceux qui ont émergé du coltar. Ils ont un joueur de... Oh, 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 Sean, he's lost the toss. He's on the brink of going out. Three, six, nine, ten players. Like, amazing that he's taken so much damage and he's still got ten players for overtime. That's crazy, isn't it? So, yeah, I mean, if Shoney had won the toss, he just wins for sure, right? Because yeah, how do you defend against all of this? He's going to be able to score a touchdown. Um, but... Yeah, this is rough now, isn't it? Yeah, the trap magnet, that was a great cast for Singolo because it stops him being stupid. <laughs> Without being mean. <laughs> it was a great cast for him to make. <laughs> he can't fuck it up now. <laughs> Sean is going to need some chunk oh, luck now, isn't he? He's, you know, Singolo should only ever give him an uphill on the ball. He's got loads of guard. We're go dwarfs. Holy Marty's, thank you for staying fantastic for three whole months. Absolutely glorious. Um, there is, there is a, is there a challenge? I don't know if there's a challenge glorious. or if you've got your no, spike bar. But Until yeah, I'm there's something somewhere. And I will defend. <laughs> I will defend. Um, I'm gonna ask. I'm gonna ask. Seeing as seeing as you've asked, I like the admins. Fuck them. Oh, PC admins even better. Right, there you go, I've asked them. And Lee Marty's gave out a sub, thank you very much Lee Marty's. Glorious. And welcome to Team Fantastic in Velocet. There you go. Ah, the playoffs. The eSports. Go. Oh, and it's even got when the matches are as well. Yak versus Gerion tonight. Well, I say tonight, this evening. I'll do that. Dio versus Chicken Sue. I'll do all of them, basically. <laughs> Well, I'll say all of them, all of them that I know about and, and you know, wake up for in time. Thank you very much, Martin Scores Easy, and oh my fucking god. That was some good timing. There's a blitz. And honestly, Singolo's defended against it pretty well, hasn't he? Singolo's defended against it pretty well. Much better than his first half setup. Where he let Shawnee through a gaping hole. This time there is no gaping hole. <laughs> it's uh, it's been interesting, Martin. It's been interesting. <laughs> Shawnee's team has got absolutely pounded in the dirt. Singolo induced three bribes and hasn't needed to use any one of them after fouling about 14 times. Um... <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, this this blitz hasn't been as devastating as it could have been. Shawnee again can't use rerolls here, can he? With only one, so he's having to be a lot con lot less conservative than he would have been if he'd had the rerolls available. He's just gone for the chunt of face to fist technique. <laughs> And he fails the first dice roll. He does re-roll it! You fucking lunatic, Shawnee! He re-rolls a three. Oh, that's lunacy. Lunacy. I don't know how you can't dodge the Ad 5 through or something. Oh, 
I don't like this. I don't like this from Shawnee. Um, yeah, I don't like. I don't. I like the fist to fist technique is okay, isn't it? But you don't re-roll it, or you don't even make the leap. I would think. But hey, what do I know? Nothing compared to Shawnee. That is simply not true. The hater the does not support style. your assertion. <laughs> and finally he gets to use a bribe! He finally gets to use a bribe! <laughs> Turn 17 of fouling every chance he's, he's had. <laughs> he finally uses a bribe on turn 17. <laughs> How are you, Styles? Oh, there's another guy gone. Ah, yeah, good, good shout, good shout, Tony. Oh dear. Yeah. Yeah, I don't really like the whole getting your whole team punched. <laughs> oh, I don't like hitting him. I like hit hitting these three and shoring up the centre. Triple bribe fail, yeah. Now it's a bit tricky to get the ball save, isn't it? Because there's suddenly a bit of weakness in the centre here. I mean, a lot of weakness in the centre here. Bet Shawnee wishes he had a dancer and a reroll at this point. <laughs> Pretty sure you can help, yep. Yeah. yeah, I really liked hitting, you know, th this long beard hitting this one because hitting him, okay, he's a good player, but I really think shoring up the middle was better there. But he might get away with it. That, that was a nice GFI, wasn't it? It was a nice GFI. That, that, that shores it up nicely. This is. This is tricky for Shoney now. The classic using the blitz to get your dancer removed and everyone else punched. And using your last reroll. Not such a good blitz. But you know, again, credit credit to Singolo for setting up against the blitz, wasn't it? He has he has done the right thing, Singolo, can't argue with that. <laughs> it's pretty disgusting, yeah. It's it's just not even good. The, the worst thing about it is it not even being good. Like, it's literally 20k to make two of these shitty long beards blitzers. Ah, he was going for the chain on the ball to get an uphill at it. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> Doesn't look great, does it? 1D for an uphill. Singolo does only have one edge three guy, yeah. Yeah, it's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. He's just got our runner, not even blitzers. Like that's that's too much. That's too much for me. I'm fine with min maxing with a runner. You know. A runner and a, a runner and a slayer, I think is totally fine. But it's crazy not to have the blitzers. But honestly, like, loads of the Russians just don't like blitzers for some reason. You can make a massive cage in the middle here, can't he? Beautiful three dice him. Unless it's a tap from Shawnee. But I don't see how it is. But he's not going for it that much. I guess he wants to get the foul on the guarder here. <laughs> he, wants, he wants the assist for the foul on the guarder. 
<laughs> and just 2D him. Yeah, 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 yeah. Most important thing was this foul, and he gets it. Oh, an actual normal foul result. Fucking finally, turn 18, there's finally a gym foul. Yeah, exactly, Fermier. Like, it's crazy not to have blitzers. In my opinion. Like, movement and edge. It kind of sucks them not having tackle. Like, it does suck them not having tackle, but come on, man. They're so good. I'd rather, I'd rather not have a Slayer. You know? I'd rather not have a Slayer and just have two Blitzers, and then it's the same TP, and you're only losing one tackle. Like, if you've got a thing about tackle, if you've got a thing about tackle, then just have a Runner and a Blitzer. But I think Edge 3... I think it's crazy to, to go that low on edge three. Yeah, exactly, hippie, yeah. <laughs> that's a true story, yeah, that's true. <laughs> that's true. Indeed, Moradam. Yeah, I just I but but that's it, that's that's the Russian way. They they genuinely just don't like They just don't like blitzes. Loads of them don't take blitzes. Uh, nothing, they're perfect. Uh, maybe nerf elves. Maybe nerf elves. Chunter and nerf rats. And nerf claw. That's the Blood Bowl 2020 solution. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Maybe keep teams constantly 1500 TV so that the Dwarves never have to have a match when they're 1000 TV down as well. <laughs> really, really, Tana. I think it's a terrible idea. And I think they're all shit and wrong for doing it. <laughs> Like, you know, there's no doubt that, like, having two re-rolls and a runner and only one runner and, like, you know, having loads of guard is great. But I really hate not having blitzers. Like, I just think it's not something that should be considered. That's just my opinion. Yeah, Sky Town, that's the thing. And, like, the fact that you probably don't get any SPP against them as well. It's like, it's horrible, isn't it? It's just depressing to play against. Like, they're all AV9 thick skulls, so you just hardly ever remove them. Hardly ever get SPPs against. They've got a good chance of stopping you scoring. And then so you've got a good chance of just not even getting any SPPs. And people really like getting SPPs. <laughs> so. Yeah, 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 exactly, Ducky, yeah. Yeah, I think a lot of people hate them for that, those kind of reasons, rather than they just think they're too powerful. Like, they're just not really too good at winning games, are they? They're not too good at winning games, Dwarves. Um, but... Yeah, strength access on Lionels is pretty busted, isn't it? Now, will he make the, uh, which kind of blitz will he make here? The sensible one. I can't believe it. Oh. Kick equity is dead! Oh my god, that could never be more appropriate. 
And as we're here on turn 20 of overtime, <laughs> with one reroll to zero. <laughs> There's no need to think about kick equity. <laughs> kick equity is dead. Oh my god, this is unbelievable, isn't it? <laughs> I was a fucking amazing player to die then, holy shit. <laughs> so good. So good. Could have made this a bit stronger, not foul, but fair enough, isn't it? You know. It's got him this far, he might as well carry on. Because like, this is the last chance Sean has got to stop him, so putting a guy here doesn't do anything. And the, and the foul there. The foul there might have removed him, which is fair enough. You know, he's a guard, fast player. But standing here would have got in the way more. So he should have fouled from this square. And this guy should have gone in there or something, I think. Because this is like absolutely shit. It's just a free touchdown, isn't it? This is Sean, his absolute last chance to stop him. So I'm fine with a foul, but this guy should have been up there somewhere. Oh, oh, back there to make that uh, no dodge, dodge in. But there you go, Shoney fails the dodge in. It was an incredible team, it was the best team in the cup, I thought. I thought it was better than Gdynik's team. Um, Gdynik has the better dancers, and I thought Shoney had, like, you know, the, the better team all around. Um, but yeah, just you know, that's it, right? There's, he, he had to survive six games without getting diced, and he didn't survive one <laughs> without getting diced. But you know, fair, again, fair play to Singolo. Singolo did did play it well. He did all the right things, didn't he? He, t he took the right inducements, had the right strategy, and uh, and rolled the right dice. So you can't fault Singolo for it whatsoever. Like it was just. Sucks to be Shawnee. Yeah, Shawnee's team's completely disgusting, yeah. Completely disgusting team. But... 1,500 dwarves. Shawnee's <laughs> rush lights. Fouling. Go fuck yourself. 1,600 times. <laughs> Was good enough. <laughs> if he gets a Kaz here, he'll level him. Oh, only the KO. Ooh. Oh, since you said it, I've got no idea. Probably, yeah. Uh, I mean, six cards total, but since you said it, I think... I, I, saw, I saw you say one. I didn't see you see two, so... Oh, unbelievable. Singolo or Slayer of Streamers. <laughs> he did it. He did it last season with his min max dwarves, didn't he? He had a good run with them as well. It's uh Fair play to him. It is, I'll be going for a nap soon, Cappy. <laughs> <laughs> wow that is unbelievable yeah I mean I think it's wrong to not take I just genuinely think it's wrong to not take blitzes like I can't get behind the zero blitzes but I mean I can get behind all of the fouls it was an amazing amount of fouling right strats wasn't it but maybe he should have pushed more in not normal time um, because if he'd lost the toss, he probably loses the game, doesn't he, there? Um, so, you know, rather than twat magneting, maybe he should have just pushed down the field and tried to score in four on his, uh, and win in normal time. But apart from that, yeah, absolutely, you know, congrats to Singolo. Um, yeah, no right store, yeah. Congrats to Singolo. Wow, the, the GFIs were terrible for him. Oh, no, they were, it's a three plus, so it wasn't that crazy. Oh god, terrible for Shawnee too. <laughs> um, leaps terrible for Shawnee. <laughs> but there you go. Um, no, congrats, congrats to Singolo. Commiserations to Shawnee. 
Thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.